And now to the 2024 presidential race. Nikki Haley in Utah today. She looks to gain some ground on former President Donald Trump ahead of Super Tuesday. The former South Carolina governor and U.N. ambassador spoke to supporters at Utah Valley University. She is digging in, even though Donald Trump has swept five red states so far. Can she pull off a surprise win here? In spite of tough odds, Nikki Haley is standing her ground. So I am enjoying the ride. I'm going to keep on fighting. We're going to keep on letting people's voices heard. Utah State University professor Damon Can says today's Utah rally could cause voters to think more about the candidates ahead of the caucus on Super Tuesday. Super Tuesday is a very important day in terms of how the presidential election will proceed uh, within the Republican uh, Party. During Haley's address today, she aimed to draw a sharp contrast to her former boss, Donald Trump. I truly think this is about the fact that we can decide whether it's going to be the RNC you know, moving in a direction of, that's all Trump, or it can be the RNC moving in a direction where we are adding to our tent and we're trying to win races up and down the board. To that point, Professor Can believes Haley could potentially pull off a surprise win in Utah. Donald Trump is certainly the front runner in every nominating contest that he appears in. Utah's caucuses uh, next week are no exception to, uh, to that. Uh, but again, uh, Nikki Haley, I think, has developed a following in uh, the state of Utah. Uh, and for some people, it's not necessarily so much Nikki Haley as it is an anyone but Donald Trump vote that they're interested in casting. I don't know whether Nikki Haley will ultimately win uh, Utah or what her chances are there. But I think uh, certainly the potential to have a stronger showing in Utah than in many other uh, hardcore red states, uh, you know, I, I think there's a legit chance of her having a, a better than average performance here as she, um, you know, continues on in this nominating process. Haley's closing pitch to the crowd. I need you to know we can do this, but we have to have faith. We have to have the will to be part of the solution. And this is a chance where Utah can show the country the direction that we want to go. And next week, Utah decides. The one last thought I would share is I hope everyone takes the opportunity to get out and participate in their caucuses uh, this coming Tuesday uh, uh, so that they can uh, be a part of the process of helping to choose our next, pre uh, next president. Okay, there you go. Super Tuesday, the next major contest for the presidential primary, meaning the nation's eyes will be on Utah. A big moment. So stay with us, your local election headquarters, ABC4, for the latest updates on that.